hey, hey, you cannot go without us talking to you guys. Team <laughs> 2, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Team 2. Back on the rally, the team Woody driving through right now. You'll be able to see. So you're looking at party tonight? Nanta, please make some noise for Team 95. Is he right? today? Is he your first time here? <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. So, are you excited to be in Atlanta? <laughs> we have a car that is built. Wow. So much power in this car. We have one of the classic cars on the way. I think this is the classic BW Beetle. Give it up for Team 87. What an No, that's a haircut. The demon got a wider front end. Does yeah, it? The, the grill, the grill like longer. I got a video of one. That colorful one came through. Wow, one next and smoke. First thing, you guys have to introduce yourselves out here. Ladies and gentlemen, give them a warm gumball free buzz and welcome. Make some noise for team number 31. <laughs> In style, in comfort, you would do it like team number nine. They are Team Kappa. Let by the man, the big, the legend. One more time, Elena. Make some noise for Team Kappa. They're going to be turning up the scene today. It's the Kappa takeover tonight. And at what Craziest entry on the rally coming from. Make some noise for team number 32! Right. Rolls Royce Ghost. It's 
getting real colourful on the grid right now. Oh, give it up for the guys with their flares and team number 18. Make some up.
that it did happen because it just still so crazy to me that I met my favorite YouTubers, DDE, Damon and Dave. So it's been easily six plus years since I've been watching them. I've been watching them all the time, nonstop. I got every notification off. They even had these hats right here. They were limited hats. They, they both autographed a hundred of them and they were $50 a piece. And I set a reminder. I was on the um, website the day of the drop, refreshing the app, refreshing, refreshing when it hit, uh, when it was at five seconds, refresh, refresh, refresh. So as soon as I hit the refresh and I seen that hat, I bought one. I ain't care about how much money I had. I ain't care about nothing. It just, just happened. So I bought the hat. I don't know how I figured out how about the Gumball rally, but I seen Gumball was coming to Atlanta this year. And I've always heard about Gumball. I just never went. Cause I never, just never went. But anyways, I heard Gumball is coming to Atlanta. I went to Atlanta. That was the last Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, so it's been a week. I hit my friend up. I was like, hey man, you trying to go to Atlanta? He said, yeah, sure, fine. Boom. I was gonna go anyway. Me and him went out there, woo, woo, woo. And we got there, and we was looking. I was like, dude, has DDE got here yet? Has they got here yet? You know, they haven't. I get a spot where the the commentators, uh, the people on the mic, they were talking, and I got right there. So when DDE came through, I get front row seats of seeing DDE, my favorite YouTubers. So we out there chilling. I'm talking about sweating, dog. I'm talking about, I, was, I, I lost a lot of weight that day. I'm sitting in the sun. I'm like, I'm not moving this spot because if I move, someone's going to take my spot, and I'm not going to be able to see DDE. One SVJ came through. It was loud. It was, I was like, bro, that gotta be DDE. That gotta be DDE. Because it was an SVJ, V12, revving, and it sounded like the SVJ. So, they came, it wasn't them. Boom. I was like, dang, man, it's not DDE. When they finally came through, I was like, nah. Like, you can just tell the difference of their Lamborghini SVJ noise and the first edgy SVJ that came through. It was completely different. If you ever heard a straight pipe, I don't even know if it's a straight pipe. I just know it's a Lamborghini Aventador SVJ with a Gintani exhaust. It sounds lovely, dog. That's why it was like, wham, bah, wham, bah. And like, I couldn't see them. I just seen like parts of the car. But then you can see like the heat, the haze from the exhaust in the crowd. And you can just tell where the car was. It was unbelievable. It, it still feels unreal. It came through, man. If you can watch their vlog too. I'm in the vlog three, four times. But anyway, you can watch their vlog. It came through. I tried to give Dave a fist bump. Boom, I missed the fist bump. Laughing. You can see that all in, them, in their vlog. I missed the fist bump. And then when I missed it, they started revving. And like I said, this car sounds amazing, dog. It is the best sounding car I've ever heard, hands down. They rev, boom, boom, boom. So they finally parked. And I'm trying to make my way, make my way, make my way. I was like, at this point, I didn't care what anybody said. I'm going to the front of anybody. I got this camera in my hand. I got a little, I got a little pool with this camera in my hand. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, dude, I'm going on that front row seat. Gotta see him. Dude, they get out of the SVJ, Damon get up. What's up, Atlanta? Everybody goes crazy. Did he, did he, did he? It was insane, dog. And this thing, you know, bro, he gets out the car and comes straight to me. And shakes my hand, dog. Bro, it was unbelievable. This dude got out the Lamborghini and came straight to me and shook my hand. He said, let's start with the hat, bro. Look, signatures, both of the signatures. Dude, he said, let's start with the hat. Shook me up. Boom. Went and talked to everybody else. I said, let me get out of everybody's way so everybody else can get their autographs and photos. And they said, you know, I went back over. I was like, Dave, I got to get a picture with both of y'all. So Dave took my phone. He took like 10 photos in my camera roll. And then Damon, he showed me this. He was like, dude, I got a cool selfie trick too on this camera. He showed, he did something on his camera. He rose it up. And then he did something on his camera. And he showed me. It was a slow motion video. After they talked to me. And then on the vlog, you see when they started going in slow motion. That was when he showed me that video. Still unbelievable. So after that, I'm still just looking. I'm like, man. So let me go find. I wanted to go talk to and meet Mike and Matt Hall. From August 
luxury motor cars in Canada that DD buy their cars from. I tried to go find them, I couldn't find them, so I found Shmi 150. Talked to Shmi, got a picture with Shmi, he's real cool. And so we went to Publix, go to the bathroom, use the bathroom, and get some drinks. So after we left Publix, I went back to the SVJ and I was just like looking. Like I told my friend, I was like, hey, I'm just gonna go look at the SVJ and just take it all in because it's still unbelievable. See, like I'm telling y'all, y'all don't understand. These are the people that made me start this YouTube. YouTube, car, like they ain't made me like car, but they just made me, they made me drift exotic cars on Forza Horizon 5. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. They literally made me do a lot of the things I do, like very inspirational, very motivational, top of the line, like these are my boys, dog. So, I'm looking at the SVJ, my friend Taylor coming behind me, I'm on FaceTime with my girlfriend, I'm like, Taylor, you know, and I told Taylor and my girlfriend, I was like, hey, you know, I'm about to go find DDE one more time, just to take it in, get some more videos of him. So, I'm on FaceTime. I got this case because of DDE. But anyways, rock for him. Carbon fiber, I can throw it anyway. But I don't do it because it, it, I might break it. So yeah, I'm on FaceTime with my girl. I'm like, look, it's freaking DDE. So I went to Snapchat and was trying to record a video. And as I'm recording this video, Damon Fryer from DDE does like this. He literally, he says, I said, dude, come here, dude. Dude, come here. And I swear to God, Damon Fryer started moonwalking dogs, bro. It sounds unbelievable, but you can ask my friend Taylor or anybody else that was there. I don't know who was there because in my mind, I only seen Damon and Dave. Still unbelievable. This dude started moonwalking to me, dog. Turned around, came straight to me again. So, and I'm on face. I'm like, dude, say hey to my girlfriend. Say hey to my girlfriend. He's like, who's this? I said, my girlfriend. Damon said, oh, this is my girlfriend. Now, snatches my phone, walks off. Insane, dog. He goes over to Dave. He's like, he's like, are y'all married? And I'm like, no. And he's like, good, Dave. You got another wife. Crazy. And then he talked to my daughter. He was asking her name. He said she's cute, gave her, I'm like, dude, this is insane. This is insane, bro. It was, it still feels unreal. Like, I still, if it focus, now look at that. That's my boy Damon, bro. Like, it still feels unreal. But, I hope that video was, I hope it explained much. I really can't relive the moment because it still feels unreal. I, I really wish I would have got my friend Taylor to record all of that, or at least some of it, bro. It was just so cool because, like, the week before I went to Gumball, like, I was literally, like, down bad, depressed, and really just felt invisible because I'm the type of person to go around saying hey to everybody. And if I don't speak first, many people are not going to speak, and it, 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 it bothers me. And the fact that... Damon, my favorite YouTubers, you know, they get out the car and come straight to me. I know it's because of the hat, but it's just still, it's crazy. And other people have merch on too, but he came to me first. It was unbelievable. Came to me first, and then he just treated me like family, bro. It made me feel visible again. And like now, like, it's just like, if I know people around here in my, in my hometown that don't like me, I'm just like, bro, you can have it. I'm not arguing with you, you know what I'm saying? I don't care anymore. You know, I'm here for a reason, though. Like, it's, it, it still feels unreal. And when I meet them again, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let them know what they done for me, and you know how they changed, they, they changed my life because it still feels unreal. Like when I look at my phone, I'm like, dude, I met my favorite YouTuber. Like literally, my favorite YouTuber. I watch these dudes faithfully. Like, I subscribe to other people and don't even watch their videos. I go rewatch DDE videos, bro. Literally. Like, it, it, it still feels unreal. It's so crazy. So crazy that they, they treated me like that. Like, treated me like family. Me and Alfred, I miss this for me and Dave. You can see that in video. We miss him. We was doing some crap like this. He was like, he was like do it again, do it again. And then we finally shook him, bro. Like, next time I see him, I'm going to ask for a hug, bro. Like, DDE, if y'all see this, I want a hug. I just want a hug, bro. Like, it's just insane, bro.
I hope this video was a little interesting. I've been thinking about this video for a week now. I, I really didn't know how I was gonna do it, but this time I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna just chop it up, boom, 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 drop the video. I didn't make an intro, this is the outro. So, my name is Isaiah Toots. Like, comment, subscribe, and we out. Peace. Yo, DDE, if y'all see this, I love y'all, man. Keep doing what y'all doing. Y'all really inspired a lot of people, and I'm pretty sure y'all know that, but if y'all didn't, I'm telling y'all now, y'all are inspirational, motivational, everything above. And when y'all come back to Georgia, let me know. And if y'all need a cameraman in Georgia, let me know. I'll do it for free. Everything I do.